guys, it's Claudia. What's up here? Today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a Littlest Pet Shop laptop, but it's not cardboard, it's paper, so this is my way of making it. For this project, you're going to need paper, scissors, uh, markers, pencils, uh, colored pencils, and yeah, that's about it. This is my little laptop, which I haven't started on. I just ripped it out, so it'd probably be best if you guys just... I don't know, cut it out. So yeah, let's just get started. We're gonna want to kind of make it like this, which is not really all that good, but let's get started. Back of this, we're gonna draw a paw print, which kind of will make it like... Which kind of like, will look like this, which will represent a little paw print, I think would be quite a good idea. Next step is you're gonna open it up and then draw your little screen for the little computer. So yeah, the screen, if you want to color them black later, that's what will come next. You're gonna draw, now you're going to draw your little keyboard, which I am not good at drawing a keyboard. Oopsies. Of course, make the space bar, but it's not going to look very all that good. If you have a better one, you can make a, I'll just try to make a video response. So yeah. I kind of like this, I'd have to say. I might make a better video, but yeah. Next, you're going to color the screen in black, or you can just leave it blank. If I were you, I'd use a black marker, a black colored pencil, or a black crayon. But I'm using a black crayon, so basically, like, I'm just going to color it in the screen. It doesn't really matter what you use, but if I were you, I would not use Sharpie, because then it's going to bleed over, but yeah. Okay, I'm trying to make this look as good as I can. I'm not very good artist here. I don't have to color the whole thing in, but it would look like that pretty good. It should look something like this. Which is not very good, but oh well. Next, I'm going to color the paw print in. You don't have to, but it's up to you. But you can use any color you want. But yeah, let's get started. You can use any color, but I'm using a pink crayon. Something like that. If you want to color the back like this part, you can, but I'm not really going to, I'm not going to, but it's up to you. This is how you make a little pet shop laptop, paper style, okay? But yeah, that's how you make a little pet shop laptop with paper, and that's my way. But if you ever, if you do that way, and you use it in your videos, make sure you give me credit for it so we don't create any drama. If you have any other how-to styles, or if you want to have a video request for me to do, make sure you comment down below so I know. Um, I'll try to do as many as I can so you guys will know. Thanks guys for watching how to make a little patch out laptop. And so yeah, bye guys!